International regulators struggle with how to oversee DeFi standards setters want to tackle the growing decentralized finance sector, but they aren't sure how to do it. International financial regulators are trying to sink their teeth into decentralized finance, DeFi, but they are split on whether they can do so simply by extending current norms. Standard setters see DeFi, which uses software to replicate traditional financial services like lending, as the next step in crypto markets. But in a series of articles published this week by financial lobby group Eurofi, regulators say they aren't sure how they can curb the risks associated with DeFi like money laundering, cyber attacks and scams. DeFi needs to instill more trust, Morten Beck, head of the Swiss Innovation Hub, wrote in one article. The Swiss Innovation Hub is run by the Bank for International Settlements, an association of the world's central banks. Today crypto insiders are exploiting users' lack of experience, Beck wrote citing scams such as front-running, where traders anticipate sales to manipulate prices. His views were echoed by the International Organization of Securities Commissions, IOSCO, a group of national regulators such as the UK's Financial Conduct Authority, which is looking to develop policies for DeFi. If DeFi can replicate financial products, it can also replicate other features of financial markets, in particular, their capacity to develop interconnections that can threaten system-wide stability, said Martin Maloney, IOSCO's secretary-general, citing the recent failure of the Anchor Protocol built on the Terra blockchain. Our ambition is to lay out a basic, internationally applicable framework. Follow the URL for the full article for more on this story. Visit the news article link.